Hi there. I'm going to show you right now how to wrap a gorgeous tichel. Um, that's actually quite simple to do, but looks very complicated from the outside. I kind of made it up while I was having a modeling session with my friend Maka in Toronto. And since posting this picture of her wearing it, I've gotten a lot of requests asking about how to do it. And really the secret of this wrap is that it's a simple wrap, but it employs angles. So the reason why I'm still wearing the scarf I put on this morning is to show you that this is just a basic regal wrap, but with a little twist and a little angle, I have created the Yael wrap, which is basically the exact same as the regal wrap, the exact same technique, um, but it looks really cool and interesting. So I'm going to unfasten my pins and take this off so I can show you. So what this wrap does is it takes a favorite t-shirt tichel, which is quite casual, and a shimmery, which is like the most fancy tichel you can get, and it puts them together, and it looks really great. So right now I have on a Wendy, and I'm, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put on my favorite t-shirt tichel, and I'm going to wrap it with the ends hanging evenly, and just tie a simple knot at the back of my head. So what I'm going to do is instead of wrapping it like this, if you have a more um, long face like mine and you don't like the whole dramatic angle look, you would wrap it um, straight. Since I'm going to show you exactly what I did on Maka, I'm going to put it on a slight angle, but keep in mind that someone with my personality and face shape, this might not be the exact best wrap, and I would probably make the angle straight if I were to actually wear this on my own. But for tutorial's sake, I will do it like this. So. Go, tie the back. And the cool thing about this t-shirt tichel is basically if you kind of pinch it like this, you get these layers that get the, like this really cool turban look thing. Okay, now I'm going to take my ends and what I'm going to do, let me just make sure the light's good enough for you, is I'm just going to wrap this around on an angle like so. You see? Let me just tilt this so it's a bit better. Okay. There we go. So right on an angle like this and then around back. So I have this kind of crisscrossy thing. And again, you can make the crisscross more dramatic if you kind of pick at the layers here. And I'm going to tuck this into the side right here. And I really don't have to worry about it being neat. Somehow I can't feel it. The wonderful thing about the t-shirt to is that it's just so soft. Sometimes it's almost too soft. Okay, there we go. There's that little place to tuck it in. There we go. Okay. Wonderful. So now I have that really cool crisscross at the front of my head. And I have this end hanging. So I'm going to do a mulberry shimmer. And basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to do... Let me just move... You can also my computer's on top of my music stand. Um, yeah, that's better, right? The light is better? Look at that. Okay. Um, I'm going to do basically beginner's luck, which is the, beginner, the easiest wrap that I know how to do. But again, I'm going to be employing angles with it. So basically, I'm going to do it with one end long and one end short. Fold it to fit my head. And I'm going to go with this angle that I have here and just follow that line in terms of tying the scarf back here. So I'm going to tie it just once at the back. I know Shalomi. Yeah. Okay, you're grabbing the music stand? Okay, he's so patient and good. Okay, so now I've got this going on and then what I'm going to do, I have to actually look at the picture and see what I did. Wait a second. Uh oh. Okay, just a second. I know, Shalami baby. Okay. Where is it? Cool. Okay, that's great. <laughs> Sorry, ladies. Okay, so that's what I did here. And this is like the struggle of every mom. Um, and now I'm going to take this end. And I'm going to bring it around, just like the beginner's luck, but instead of having a nice clean angle, I'm going to crisscross it to the front like this, see? So now I basically got that exact zigzag there. 
And now I'm going to take this end here and securely tie it. Now you'll see on Malka I made the um, angles a little more dramatic because her face and personality could handle it. On me I'm doing it a bit softer. Yeah. Okay, so this end here I'm going to tuck away at the, in the back. Just find a little pocket here to shove that away. I'm almost done and basically the only thing I have left to do, let me just look at the picture again, is just putting the last Jersey Joy around nice and straight. So it's going to take it, I kind of fold it so the ends are facing in and I bring it here basically so the knot is showing and bring it around like so. Oh, the lighting is so weird. I don't know what's going on with my computer lately. And that's my phone. Okay. Well, we're almost done. And I will call that person back later. And then I'm tucking it in at the side right here. And once again, you can also adjust it so the, the jersey scarf, the t-shirt scarf, gets some nice little pleaty angles here. Okay? So there you have it. That's the Malka. And... It's really, really beautiful. For, for those of you that are a little shy of the shimmery um, and find that sometimes it pinches your head and it's like a little scratchy feeling, this allows you to wear the shimmery without it touching your head. And um, it's actually really very, very comfortable and beautiful. So while I did like the tichel I had on before, I think I'm gonna leave this one on for the rest of the day. Okay, hope you enjoy. Uh, I'm gonna turn around because some people were requesting that I do a turn around. So there we go. Hope you can see everything. Ta-da! Okay, bye everyone!